Hello once again guys, I hope you're good and welcome back to another video. Today we've got another top 20 bargains from a certain nation and it's a big one, it's Belgium. Obviously Belgium have some incredible youngsters in this game, but are there any going for prices that you won't believe? Well this is the top 20, so let's see who made it in. So we begin with the first of three Belgian keepers, Jens Tunkins. A teenage prospect that you can easily collect for less than 1 million at the beginning of career mode. 6 foot 2, 60 rated and with the stats you'd expect a 60 rated goalkeeper to have. 3 star weak foot, 1 star skills and a low potential of 73. Not at all a breathtaking keeper but if you're playing as a 2 star team with a lack of budget maybe he can do a job. Pick him up for 325k and 1275 a week. And up next is Alexis Dessart, centre defensive mid by trade, 19 years old, 5 foot 11 and with an overall of 61. Pretty good defensive stats for his rating and could be an integral part of your league 2 squad if you decide to bring him in. Medium high, 3 star, 2 star which is pretty well suited for his position and with a potential of 73. He's in the same boat as Jens in terms of not being amazing but as a squad player for a low rated team. He could do well for 400,000 and 1,275 a week. In at 18th is the first defender on this top 20, Jules Van Klimput. These three players have been perfect ones to pick up for a road to glory style career mode. Cheap, decent potential, but not decent enough that it won't be painful to sell them off later. 19 years old, 6 foot, 60 rated, medium, medium, 3 star, 2 star and a potential of 74. He's going for a price of 0.425 million and 1,275 a week. Our next player is coming at just 17 years old, but he's already got one stat at 90 rated, Mohamed Zuriel. Center attacking midfielder, 5 foot 5, 56 rated and possessing phenomenal balance. Other than that, everything else is pretty much below par. 65 short passing, 63 curve and 61 ball control. Medium, medium, 4 star, 3 star and a potential of 74. Again would go nicely with the previous players straight into a League 2 side and at 210k and 1275 a week he's hardly going to take a massive chunk of your transfer budget away. 16th is another centre back option in Jordi Waldenberger. 20 years of age, 6 foot 2, 65 rated. 75 strength, 74 acceleration and 71 shot power. 69 stamina, 68 sprint speed, 65 stand tackling. Medium, medium, 3 star, 2 star and a potential of 75. Overall, a pretty average signing with training could probably turn into a pretty deadly centre back but it'll cost you 0.775 million and 2,800 a week. Check him out. Coming in now is Nordin Jackers. Goalkeeper, 18, 6 foot 1, 60 rated. 2 star weak foot, 75 potential, not really much more to mention than that. He's an option for the financially cursed. If you're interested, go and throw Genk a bid of 0.525 million and offer him 1,275 a week and he should be coming to your club. Okay, so as of now, the potentials are back to better than average level and Joris Kayom of Porto is the first one to start that trend. He's 21 years old, 5 foot 11, 68 rated in the first season. Good pace for a winger with 85 sprint speed and 78 acceleration. 74 dribbling, 71 agility, 71 ball control and 70 balance. Medium, medium, full star, 3 star and a reasonably good potential of 77. His price is well worth what he can offer your new club, going at 1.1 million and 8,000 a week. In at 13th is an already well gifted left midfielder in Leonardo Trossard. Of all the players today, Leonardo is one to note down, especially if you've got a budget of around 5 million. 21 years old, 5 for 8, 86 agility, 86 balance, 83 sprint speed, 81 acceleration, 74 dribbling, 73 curve. High medium, 3 star, 3 star and with a good potential of 79. That can be easily outgrown with consistent training. He's only going to knock off 2.9 million from your transfer budget and his wages are fair in my eyes at 8,000 a week. And next in the list is on the other side of midfield, it's Andy Kawaya. I feel like when he reaches his potential, he'll be a very similar player to Antonio of West Ham. 84 balance, 83 jumping, 81 strength. 
80 sprint speed, 79 acceleration and 76 agility. The strength and speed combination is always extremely beneficial down the wing. Medium, medium, 3 star, 3 star and a potential of 76. He probably isn't going to turn into a world beater but could easily be a player who is far better than his stats suggest. And when his price is 850k and wages are 3,100 a week, he's a hell of a bargain to check out. And now to Timothy Castonge, the right back from Genk. A pretty decent option for a championship side. In the first season, he could really be pushing for first team football with his starting overall of 70. 20 years old, 5 foot 11, well rounded too in both defending and attacking. And with his high, high work rates, he could be a very useful fullback in your squad. And he's got a potential of 79. So if you're looking for one, Timothy Castange is going for 2.8 million and 7,100 a week. Halfway through sits a very decently rated centre back, Dries Wouters. 63 overall, 6 foot 2, 19 years old, 78 strength, a good frame to build a championship level defender around. Great work rates too for a centre back with low medium. 3 star, 2 star and an okay potential of 75. Wouldn't be a first team starter for the entirety of his career, but as a squad rotation player he'd definitely get a spot. Like what you see, 0.525 million and 1,300 a week is what you're going to need. Next in the top half is Brian Hainan, another player from Genk and he looks like a special pickup. 19 years of age, an overall of 67 and well rounded for his position. High high work rates are always helpful and if you were looking for a box to box style midfielder, he's one to be sending your scouts to watch. 4 star weak foot and a good potential of 79. 1.3 million and 4,800 a week is all you'll need to collect his signature. And we come on to probably my favourite Belgian to pick up this year. If you've started a career mode save with a low tier Premier League club, get Bajon Engels on your wish list. He's 21 years old, 6 foot 4 and 76 rated in the first season. 79 heading accuracy, 76 strength, 76 aggression, 76 stand tackling, 75 composure and 75 interceptions. He has every bit about him to become a top level defender and if you bring him straight into the Premier League, he'll fit right in because I've done it many times already. Possibly a future captain for your new club and going at 10 million and 15,500 a week is outstanding. Get him before he's gone. Sitting in the 7th position is Ismail Azawi of Wolfsburg, just a young prodigy sitting in the youth ranks of the German club. Ismail is an extremely well hidden gem in career mode. 18 years old, 5 foot 10, 61 rated, his stats aren't astounding to begin with but training sessions saw that problem out pretty quickly. High medium, 3 star, 3 star and a potential of 79. 450,000 and 4,600 a week is what it's going to take to bring him in. Sixth is Theo Bangonda, a major upcoming world-class talent and it's quite surprising that he didn't come in the top three. 20 years old, 76 rated, 5 foot 10, extremely good first season stats, medium medium, 3 star weak foot and 4 star skills. A massive potential of 86 which as always can be outgrown if you devote enough training sessions to him. Celta Vigo are happy to see him leave for 12 million which is amazing for a future world class talent and he's only currently earning 19 and a half thousand a week. Check him out. Just behind the top four, Leonardo Dendonka, defensive midfielder and a great one at that. Again, extremely well suited to a low end Premier League team with his 76 starting overall. He's also got pretty decent height in the midfield at 6 foot 2 and he's just 21 years old. 82 stamina, 81 shot power, 77 strength, 77 reactions, 77 short passing, 76 interceptions, medium high, 4 star weak foot and 2 star skills, and with a potential of 83. Truly a great find for 10.5 million and 15,500 a week. Only just missing out on a medal is Dante Rigo of PSV, another 17 year old with some really high potential. 5'11", 64 overall, 73 short passing, 72 vision, 70 long passing, 68 ball control, 67 acceleration and 67 agility. Medium, medium, 4 star, 3 star and a potential of 82. If you want this young prodigy, 1,200,600 a week, that's what's required. 
Coming in third is Thibaut Vlientank. A right wing option for those with less than 1 million to spend on new players. He's an 18 year old rough looking gem to begin with. 61 rated, 5 foot 10, decent pace and some other fairly alright stats for his beginning overall. Medium, medium, 4 star, 3 star and a potential of 80. Obviously you've got some work to do with this guy but at a price of just 600k he's just an excellent investment for the future. And he's only on 2,400 a week. And in second, another one of my favourites to buy this year. It's the young and elect keeper, Mile Svilla. He's just 16 years old, 6 foot 2 and 63 rated. I always loan this guy in if I can't quite afford him. 63 reflexes, 63 handling, 62 reactions, 61 positioning, 61 diving. A huge 83 potential and for the sheer fact that you can sign this guy up for less than 1 million and 1,275 a week makes him one of the best bargains in the whole of FIFA 17 this year. And receiving the gold medal for this top 20 countdown is, hopefully you've guessed it by now, he's been career mode's most wanted player since FIFA 14, it's Yuri Thielmans. Do I need to go into a lot of detail about this future world class centre midfielder? Surely you all know just how amazing this young Belgian can become right? 19 years old and already 77 rated, 5 star weak foot, very very complete stats and a huge potential of 87. He has been docked a little bit since the start of FIFA 17 this year, but you can still get him up to his 90 rating with training, so don't miss out on him for 15.5 million and 13 thousand a week. So that's all the bargain Belgians I've got for you. A good mix of players and a good mix of prices so there should be at least a couple perfect for your new career mode save. But that's this video done. If you like the video be sure to let me know by pressing that like button. Stay subscribed for plenty more top 10s, 20s, 25s and other career mode videos and I brace for impact and thanks for watching.